I think the English countryside is unique because of the changing the seasons one day to the next can be very, very different, different light qualities. You get that sort of pale sunlight and the paler blues of the sky. There is a particular spirit to the countryside that you fall in love with. Uh, the idea for the collection started looking at some of the modern 20th century artists and I think they captured the spirit of the British landscape so well and in particular the unique light. The colours I chose, which was aquamarine and heliodor and sort of green beryl, were all chosen to reflect that. I wanted the collection to look both backwards and forwards at the same time, so it would be reflecting on Boodle's pieces and collections from the past, but then also adding a new element, and in a sense the landscape was the muse for that new element. There are also parts of Boodle's aesthetic language that uh, run throughout the collection, so it'd be things like flowing lines, a sense of harmony, the combination of colours that all join together, really, to provide the Boodle's look. It's roughly about two years from starting to just formulate initial ideas on how the collection might take shape, and then researching it gathering together different photographs, different imagery, working through the stages of the sketches and finalising the designs and then of course the work of the goldsmith to turn them into reality. I can't wait to see the finished um, book that's coming out with it. Seeing the photographs and seeing how well they represent the pieces of jewellery is just wonderful.